Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to check up your Tesla Model Y. So this would apply if you want to do a tire rotation yourself or change to winter tires or summer tires. I'm going to change to winter tires. So if you check the manual, under the manual you have a section called checking and lifting and there is a checking procedure explained. So it doesn't say very much but there are a few warnings and here is an illustration of the checkpoints so there are four checkpoints in the bottom of the car so you have to kind of imagine that the car is on its side and this is the bottom of the car but don't worry I'm going to show you under the car what it actually looks like it's not green but uh, it's just green for illustration purposes here uh, what you should keep in mind is um, don't try checking up the car anywhere else than on these points because uh, the battery is down there and you might damage something if you don't use those check points and it also says uh, you should remove your charging cable and I know some other Tesla models have a, a checking mode which so you need to go on the service and then uh, go into checking mode because the suspension might require a setting like that on this uh, Model Y uh, from 2023 made in Europe uh, there is no check mode so I'm just going to unplug the charging cable and then going ahead with the checking unfortunately it's raining but I'm going to do this anyway because I need to change the tire so the check point uh, for the front is somewhere under here. I uh, hope you can see this. So it has this little hole in it and uh, that's where the check pad would go in. So uh, it's advisable to use a check pad uh, don't push the check uh, uh, directly on here because you might might slip or damage something there's a check pad uh, with the hole which or with the thing which goes in here uh, helps keeping it in place but I imagine that you might already need to change the wheels when you're watching this so a hockey puck is my go-to for things like this so I'm going to put the hockey puck here and then check the car up from here and uh, yeah the link down below for a check pad you can check that out if if you still have time to order one so that's what it looks like when I have the hockey puck positioned I think the best way possible and then the check is underneath but yeah again it's a lot easier with the check pad so I'm going to definitely buy the check pad and don't play me blame me if you slip like this uh, rather be safe and get a check pad for the Tesla so the next it's just a matter of checking up the car and I think I have seen some Tesla mobile service people not using the actual check pad so maybe this is not that risky but you should be careful and one thing to note is that the tes Tesla is actually very rigid so it should be quite easy to check up from the front and get both sides uh, no, I mean the front and the back up so that you can change or rotate the wheels and then maybe you can put, put one of the check stands underneath the rear um, check point so this is well, a bit hard to see. 
So this is what it looks like with both both uh, the rear and the front in the air. But yeah, you should put a check stand for safety over there. And yeah, you should also uh, remove the hubcaps. There's a video down below in the description for that. And then loosen up the lug nuts slightly so before it's in the air because it will be a lot easier to loosen them up when it's still on the ground. Uh, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up.